Brazil turned on the style, dancing their way to a one-sided 4-1 win over South Korea in their World Cup round of 16 match at Qatar's Stadium 974 on Monday. Vinicius Jr., Neymar, Richarlison and Lucas Paqueta were all on the scoresheet in a dominant first half as Brazil cruised into a quarter-final matchup against 2018 World Cup finalists Croatia on December 9. Bonagur, Neymar's return has Brazil dancing into quarters World Cup bracket, who plays whom? With 82-year-old Brazil legend Pele cheering the team from a hospital while recovering from a respiratory illness, Vinicius wasted no time putting his side ahead, settling a cross from Rapinha that found him unmarked at the back post and calmly curling a shot into the side netting. Let's hope we see a And we are also sending a big hug to Pele. Let's hope he recovers quickly. South Korea's Young Woo Young fouled Richarlison in the area minutes after the opener to give Neymar a chance to double the lead. The Paris Saint-Germain star made no mistake from the spot, sending goalkeeper Kim Sung gyu the wrong way to make it 2-0 inside of 15 minutes. The goal was Neymar's 76th for Brazil leaving him one short of tying Pele for most goals scored in the country's famous yellow jersey. We're dreaming of the title, of course, Brazilian talisman Neymar said. Today was the fourth game, there are three left. We're very focused on getting that title. Rich Arlison made it 3-0 before the half-hour mark sliding the easiest of finishes into the South Korean goal following some brilliant individual skill and clever interplay with Thiago Silva at the top of the penalty area. For their fourth goal of the first half, Brazil hit a helpless South Korea with a counterattack that saw Neymar feed Vinicius, who in turn scooped across for the onrushing Paqueta to side foot home with his first touch. Tottenham Hotspur's Son Hung Min forced a great save from Allison just after the restart, and Rapinha was twice denied at the other end as he looked to add to Brazil's talent.